welcome to the project demonstration of smart credits okay see? smart credit and uh, in this project we have the features like live streaming monitoring with the help of this camera which was attached to the raspberry pi and also continuously we can access the parameters which are related to this baby near sensors like humidity and temperature from this dh double one and sound monitoring from the sound sensor so when the sound detects automatically the system will switch on the music with the help of this df mini player in this memory card we have already stored the uh, slow musics and next that will be announced uh, played from the speaker based on the input from the sound sensor by using this Arduino you know. and also the system will start rotation of this cradle with the help of this servo motor slowly and also if is there any like wetness was detected the wetness percentage 0 to 100 percent continuously monitored on this blink application so we can access the humidity and temperature and sound level and wetness so these four parameters continuously monitor from anywhere in the world using this blink application just click on this credit as of now offline because the device is not connected to the internet it is off state that is offline so we can get the data over here right so when we click on that we can see that so these are the parameters humidity temperature and wetness and this is the sound as of now it is blank nothing but there is no sound detected so whenever the sound detects automatically this is uh, there will be a led on uh, on this slot so now let us see demonstration before on the kit very first step is we need to on the hotspot in your phone and uh, install the blink cloud blink iot application from play store and log into the blink application uh, the id and password was written back side of this cardboard and to change the hotspot name to cradle project all are small letters without any space without any capital letter and password should be one two three four five six seven eight nine after enabling the hotspots and data then log into the blink application and also one more application we need to install that is network analyzer in order to access the live streaming from this usb camera with the help of this uh, raspberry pi here and now on the power supply just connect this b type cable at this slot of the raspberry pi and now on the power supply to that right connect it gently and next on the power supply to that then initially it will be stabilized and a welcome message will be displayed on the on the lcd screen after that humidity and temperature temperature degree centigrade and humidity percentage continuously displaying on the screen as of now the sound increase when i'm talking the sound increases so the music played from the speaker as well as the cradle started rotation so we can set the sensitivity also on this one uh, sound sensor when the second light is get switched on it's an indication of sound detected right now it is normal it's off again so if i speak loudly then automatically it was detected and uh, it start rotation of this servo motor you can see that so now in order to set the sensitivity anti clockwise the sensitivity will be decreases see so the second light is not getting switched on anti clockwise rotation sorry clockwise rotation decreasing the sensitivity anti clockwise rotation increasing the sensitivity right now this is cradle operation and music player was successfully done and next in order to access the live streaming before that check whether the device is connected in your mobile phone or not okay the raspberry pi is connected in your mobile phone now test it again so now we can see the device is online now right so you can see the parameters humidity and temperature so once again with the baby crying so music started and the credit also start rotation so you can see the red light indication as you see that now it is normal okay there is no red light indication here previously if you stay on this screen when you make the sound over there then you can see the red light over here so let us see that for making abnormal condition just i'm rotating this for anti-clockwise rotation so you can making the sound right okay anti-clockwise less sensitivity clockwise 
so anti clockwise we can increase the sensitivity more sensitivity clockwise rotation we can decrease the sensitivity so we can see the indication on this blink application also okay and coming to the like weight sensor so when we am placing the weight over there so we can see the weight percentage also got increased so just wipe off this and place it in the cradle right again it is normal right okay and coming to the live streaming so to see the live streaming we can see the two device connected over here so two device connected in your hotspot settings and uh, to check the live streaming go to network analyzer application and do LAN scan do the scan right so they will get the two IP addresses three actually one is your mobile phone another is our raspberry pi another is our ESP32 just copy one of them any one of them and open that so if you don't get streaming and next copy the another one sorry this 32 one open Actually, we need to copy this. Right. Actually, not open directly. Copy this IP address. Now go to Google Chrome, paste over here, and at the end type colon eight zero eight one. Okay. Now enter. So we are getting the streaming directly over here. Okay, so you can adjust the camera also. Right. Fine. So the live streaming from the camera and uh, in the blink application we can get the like uh, sound detector or not or wetness and humidity temperature continuously monitoring. So we have interfaced this input and output modules to the Uno board along with uh, Raspberry Pi. So Raspberry Pi for live streaming purpose, Uno board to read the data from the sensors so dsc double interface at the pin number 10 and pin number 22 pin number 7 for the 16 by 2 lcd screen and the weight sensor is connected at the a1 and a0 for the sound sensor and uh, like esp8266 wi-fi module to upload the data to think speak right It's a, if it is moved from out of this shaft, just press it. When you're on that, it's normal position. Okay. 